Hi, so today I just have a craft haul for you, you guys. I know I haven't been making videos for a long time. I've just been really busy with my homework and schoolwork trying to get this end of the year done. So as you see here, I just got some different stuff. This is some woodblock stamps that my auntie gave me that she found at a garage sale. This was its um, a old Stampin' Up! stamp set. You can see here it's this Fishy Friends kind of stamp set. So I... I got to use it actually on one of my cards and it, I'm hopefully going to be able to upload that video soon too. As you see here, she also got these stamps and you can see these are nice Hawaiian stamps that I can use for all different kinds of cards. Also you can see here it has it's a, more woodblock stamps, these three nice sentiments there. And then also I have these alphabet stamp set and this is this is really nice it's from hero arts and it seems to be an older stamp set probably retired and it's really good so that i'm able to go ahead and be able to make personalized kind of cards and projects and as you see here too i got some different things from target my Target finally got in these different things. I went to the Kailua Target for the local people. And then I found these this burlap ribbon as well. There's two different types. There's this, that plain burlap ribbon. Also, this one has a frayed edge on the bottom. And then also, I got these crocheted laces that I got to use this on a, a couple cards already. And it's really nice, and it's a nice accent to any kind of card. Also, I got some new things from Amazon. I went ahead and ordered some more markers for myself. I really like my Spectrum Noir, so I just got a couple more sets. I got the turquoise set and the green set. And as you can see here, that's the turquoise set. You get some really nice shades of the BT colors. And as well as I got the green set. And it has all different shades from mossy tones to nice lime green colors. So it's really nice. I'm able to f kind of fill up my collection slowly uh, but surely. Also, as you see here from Paper Smooches, I got this hoodie stamp set. And from Mama Elephant, I got this Zethlin's Borders. Or Zenith Borders. And as you can see here, those are nice accents to... Or that border stamp set can be nice accents to my card. Also from Lawn Fawn, I got this the Stitch Scalloped Edge Border Dies. As well as from Paper Smooches, I got this Stitch Dies. Which just makes some nice stitching marks into your cards. I got to use this too and it's really nice and it gives a nice added detail but without having to do any kind of actual cutting because it just leaves the stitching marks. Also from Ross I picked up all of these cardstock packs you can see here because it's 48 sheets and I just got it has in from these pink to red tones and this is really nice I got they're pretty good quality too they're maybe like maybe 65 pound weight. It doesn't say on the packaging really, so I'm just estimating about that. And you can see here, I also got two sets of the blue pack because I use a lot of blue cardstock. So this, it comes with many shades, so I just went ahead and got two of those as well. Also, my again, my auntie got me more of these um, from a garage sale, and this is actually the Basil cardstock, and this is really good kind of heavy duty thick cardstock it's also textured i never had any of the basil cardstock for so for her to find that at a garage sale for a really good price was really nice and you can see it's in the blue and purple tone also she got a couple other sets i got this gr it's like a warmer gray tone set and you can see there also it this mustardy yellow so this is really nice it came with all these some really nice sheets. I never got to use them yet, but it's a good addition to my collection. So please visit my blog at michaelscrafts.blogspot.com to see more of my other card projects. And thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.